Hey guys, today um, I actually want to talk about something and I have a whole bunch of videos that I made like two weeks ago that I'm supposed to put on but I'm very busy with like thesis stuff and school shit. Um, so what I've decided to do is actually just put this video up right away because something happened over the weekend that I really want to talk about and it, it has to do with like an awkward family like situation that happened and I don't ever talk about family like my personal family I talk about like other people's family and like how to deal with your family but like I never really personally talk about my own family maybe just my dad um but this this is very uh it, it's it's it it's funny but it's also like ooh okay so just keep that in mind but keep in mind that I am smiling now and that's why I'm making a video it's not a bad video so if the person then this happened and the person is watching it which she might. Um, it's nothing bad, I just need to talk about it because it was funny and yeah, let's do it. So I'm wearing this like really cool shirt, oh my god, this is like the coolest shirt I've ever owned. Anyways, it's by Flaunt Street, it's Flaunt? Yeah, I feel like I'm saying that wrong. I feel like I'm supposed to be saying Flan. I don't know why, I'm thinking of like Sabrina the Teenage Witch when there's like Flan. Anyways, I'll put the link, whatever. So, I was at my second cousin's wedding. My second cousin is like 50 and she was getting married and it was great and I was like helping with stuff, blah blah. And her brother was there who lives in Toronto or something. And um, his kids and his wife were there and I hadn't seen them in maybe eight years. Um, something like that, seven years, let's say six to seven years, I'm being dramatic, but you know me. So, <laughs> um, I'm gonna skip to the part where uh, the event happens, the, this, this thing. So I, I wanna like situate it so you understand. So this is a table and my cousin's second cousin, I'll just say cousin just because it's easier. Um, uh, her ex is right there and like she's still part of like the family, like whatever, they were together for like 15 years or something, God, you don't just like over. So she's there and um, one of the kids of my cousin's brother is there, so my third cousin. I know this is getting really confusing, okay? Let's just like restart so you understand. I'm at a table, I'm here, right here is someone, and right here is my third cousin. My third cousin says to this person, and I'm not gonna say my birth name only because like, no, not happening. Um, I'll pretend my name was Sabrina. <laughs> ew. <laughs> I'm not saying ew if your name is Sabrina, I'm just whatever. <laughs> so I'm sitting at, at the, I'm not sitting on, at the table, but I'm like leaning, so my like leg is up and I'm like this, okay? And I'm like looking at the person right here, okay? So the, the third cousin here says, where is Sabrina? And then I'm just like this, looking at the person, wanting to see what's gonna happen. And she's like, what do you mean? Like, where's Serena? Like, blah blah, like an old nickname or something? And then she's like, yeah. <laughs> this person here says, well, there's Chase now. And I'm just like looking like, I wanna see what's gonna happen here. This is really confusing, I know, I'm sorry. And then she, the third cousin's like, Okay, really confused. So this is what I do. I'm literally like this. It me. <laughs> I literally like, mm, it's me. And then like, it took her like a couple of seconds to like, oh my god. <laughs> it's just, it's so funny. Um, it, like the beginning was just like, oh my god, my face was red. I was like, oh my god, is she joking? Like, is she just like, what's happening? And then, um, it feels good that she thought of me, but it's also weird that she didn't know. I feel like the whole family knew, even though I'm not close to them, like, I feel like my second cousin would have told. I guess not. Whatever. Cool. So, yeah, it took her a couple of seconds, and then she, like, hugged me, and then we, like, started talking about this, and apparently there's, like, someone, because she's younger, I think she's 18, um, and, uh... Uh, younger than me. I'm not saying like young is 18. I'm just saying like she's younger than me um, she, There's like someone trans in her school or something and I don't know it was it was really uh, it was it, it was the weirdest like coming out That I've ever had to deal with in my entire life and it's just like it's so entertaining to just think about it It in the beginning. I just like I really 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 don't like to hear um, that name just cuz like like it's like I feel so uncomfortable. I, th I thought that after a while, like I was like not like I was not bothered by it anymore. But then I don't know. After this happened, and like so many other people had said my name during that wedding, and I was like, come on, my old name. Ugh. Mm. Also, I don't like calling it my dead name. So if you say that in the comments, please don't. I really don't like that. And I also don't like calling it my birth name. I just call it my old name. So then, like her mom comes in, which I guess is my second cousin's wife. This is so confusing when it's like family because my second cousin is my dad's cousin and I'm like close to her 
um, and I've been closer for a long time, and it's like that side of the family is like, it's all like third cousins and then like removed and like in-laws, and it's very confusing. But so the mom comes in, and then the, the third cousin is like, um, did you know that that's Chase or something like that? And then she's like, Chase, Chase, why does that sound familiar? And then she said like, oh, it's Sabrina. She's like, oh, yeah. And she like looked a bit confused and then she's like, okay, we have to go. <laughs> anyway, so that was a bit, uh, it, I don't know. That's, you know, it's a story for the kids. You know, I don't think I'll ever forget that story. Um, just there were happened, like other things happened during um, the, the like reception, which was just like, someone came up to me and I hadn't seen them in a while and they were just like, Sabrina? Like, that's not my old name, I'm just, I don't know why. I'm gonna pretend like that's my name now, my old name. And they were like, Sabrina, I'm like, it's Chase now. And they were like, what? And I'm like, I go by Chase now. Like, hello, like you wanna call me Sabrina and I look like this, is, what? Also, trigger warning, for real, for people who like, their old name is Sabrina, I'm sorry. I'm just, I, I just, yeah, I'm sorry. And then two people on separate occasions, which I've known for such a long time, they knew me before I transitioned, and they know me now, and they're like cool. Both said like, I don't care what people do. Like literally, it was like almost the exact same thing, just at separate times. They're like, um, you know, I don't care what people do. Like before I knew you as Sabrina, and now you're much happier now as Chase, and it doesn't matter. And you know, blah, blah, and you decided to be male, or something like, the, the wording was off, but their intentions were right. But then one of them was just like, out of the blue, we were talking about fireworks and then they started asking me about like my bottom stuff. <laughs> what? How did fireworks go? I don't even, I don't even, I don't want to go there. I don't understand. It was very confusing and I was just like, I, I don't have time to think about bottom surgery, which I know is really sad because all I think about bottom surgery, like it's something that's constantly on my mind. But it's also like I don't have time to emotionally invest myself in the idea that I'm going to get it soon because I have so many other things to do and I also have so many things to do in my emotional state and stuff like that. I did do a mental health update like two weeks ago that I haven't posted yet so I am planning on posting that when um, my thesis writing stuff, I have a deadline coming up so when, when that kind of like dies down a little bit and I have a little bit more time, I'll be able to post all those videos um, and I am going to start captioning my videos. Um, just because I feel like I've been wanting to do that forever and I am going to take the time now to do that because I think it is really important. Anyways, that's all um, for this like really re- oh, I just moved the camera. Anyways, this- this- I don't know. What do you think of this story? Is that weird? What, what kind of stories have you had that's like really awkward? Like that awkward? Like obviously like it's just honestly made me feel so great though that she literally didn't recognize me because right before that we were talking about how these maple cookies that I haven't had in eight years are like vegan and I didn't know they were vegan and I just had two and they were amazing and then she's like oh isn't it hard being vegan and like, it was just like two strangers talking where I thought she knew who I was because she was like oh that's a picture of me on the fridge I was like oh yeah I know like I feel like she figured out that I, I knew her when she was like a kid kid like 11 well apparently she didn't and it's like I don't know it's, it's cool that like she literally looked at me and like we, we, we had a face to face conversation and she didn't see it. That makes me feel like wow, like I know I still look the same but it's so like, I don't know, it's a weird feeling to know that somebody in your family literally did not recognize you when you literally had a conversation for like 20 minutes. I don't know, it's interesting. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Um, have a great week and I will see you soon, bye.